Hello. Today I'm going to show you a very basic rollover and roll out functions in ActionScript. Basically what I want to do is when you roll over a certain area or an object, a photo will appear. I'll show you how to do that. Um, if you have any questions about this or other tutorials or um, have any comments about the, the podcast, feel free to email me at freeadobeflashtutorials at gmail.com. If you uh, want to download more tutorials or find links to articles or information about Flash, you can check out my website at www.freeadobeflashtutorials.com. Okay, first thing we need to do is create a new layer for our action script. So we're going to label this bottom layer action so that we don't get confused. On our top layer, we're going to create our objects. First of all, I'm going to make a button or an area at least to roll over. Next, I want to import an object that we can turn on and off. I'm just going to import the icon button. Okay, the first thing we need to do is turn these both of these objects into movie clips. Let's select our button. We want to make it a movie clip. In the properties panel, we want to also call this movie clip button underscore mc for movie clip. We'll also turn this photo into a movie clip by pressing F8. We'll label that photo so we remember what it is. And we'll call this one photo underscore MC for movie clip. So we have button MC and photo MC. And the purpose, or what we want to do is when we scroll over the button, the photo appears, and when we scroll off, the photo disappears. Let's go to our action script layer. You can find the action script panel by going to Windows Actions. I just have it down here next to my properties. First thing we need to do is turn off the photo, or turn off the visibility of the photo. So we'll call on our movie clip, photo MC, period, underscore, visible, equals false. What that'll do is the photo basically won't appear. Now we're going to call on our button, MC underscore mc period on roll over equals function parentheses open bracket close bracket photo underscore mc underscore visible equals true and what that'll do is when you roll over our button movie clip our photo will become visible now it will stay visible until something tells it to turn it off so let's call on our button again, and this time, instead of roll over, roll out equals function, parenthesis, photo, underscore mc, dot, underscore visible, equals false. So that basically, it'll turn off the photo when we first enter the Swift. When we roll over our button, it will become true. Our and when we roll off of the button, the photo will disappear again. So let's test our movie by pressing Apple or Control Enter. So you see our photo is gone, and as we roll over the button, the photo appears and also disappears when we roll off. That's a very basic um, tutorial on rollovers and rollouts. Again, it can be used in a lot of different applications, it's just as basically as creative as you want to get, creating interactive flash objects. Thank you very much. Um, if you have any questions about this or any other tutorials, feel free to email me at freeadobeflashtutorials at gmail.com. If you want to check out links, uh, articles, um, more websites, or other flash tutorials, check out www.freeadobeflashtutorials.com. Thank you.